all the video tapes uh, that has been released over the past couple of months of Deontay Wilder uh, in the gym, hitting the pads, hitting the, the big bag, uh, training with big logs. I have yet to see Deontay Wilder uh, doing any sparring, like live sparring, actually getting hit with punches, getting himself back used to taking punches. But I want to know if uh, Deontay Wilder can really implement a change in the ring under fire. When I say under fire, I don't mean uh, two boxers dancing around uh, like a chess match. I mean under fire with rapid concession with uh, someone coming at you, such as Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson, uh, I'm quite sure there's been plenty of people to say, uh, well, I'm bigger than Mike Tyson, I'm taller than him, so all I have to do is jab and keep him at a distance, which a lot of people found out that that was uh, very hard to do. So I would like to know if boxing fans, if you think that Deontay Wilder can go in the ring and actually implement a new training of, you know, just a different Deontay Wilder. Is this possible? Like, uh, I can see if you let him come in and set up and, you know, you both guys are just uh, casing each other, trying to find an opening. And if you give Deontay Wilder that kind of time, then of course he's going to catch you with that right hand. When he, Deontay Wilder has developed a a left hook that nobody never speaks of, but he really don't throw it that much. He, he's not really a body puncher. He's, he's to me, he's a head, hunt, head hunter, but I've seen in his new videos where he uh, he's changing, he's, he's getting out of the way of punches. But I don't, I don't know if it's too late in the stage of his career, you know, something that you haven't been practicing all your life. And you have to remember that uh, Tyson Fury and, and Anthony Joshua are uh, extensive amateur careers. Uh, Anthony Joshua is a, a gold medalist. So these guys are trained, and Deontay Wilder started boxing quite late. So when he came in, Deontay Wilder is more of just a fighter, like somebody that just fights you. But he's, he's developed a lot of skills while learning though. He, uh, Deontay Wilder basically uh, learned on the job. Like Tyson Fury then was trained for the job. Anthony Joshua, he was trained for the job. So I, I'm, I'm uh, uh, waiting to see if Deontay Wilder can stick to a plan. You know, the plan that uh, his trainer has drawn up for him. You know, plans are easier to plan than to really be in the ring. But I think Wilder, Wilder is a good fighter. He brings certain aspects to the division, to the heavyweight division. You know, the bomb squad, the, you know, the, the intimidation. And Tyson Fury is more like the Muhammad Ali of this time. So Anthony Joshua has kind of a, I don't want to say a George Foreman personality. You know, he he has a little bit more laughter than Foreman. Foreman was was quite, kind of quite dull in his uh, upbringing. Foreman uh, turned to, started to get a personality later in his career, you know, after he's seen what what people wanted. People want someone that's charismatic. You know, Tyson, Tyson Fury is very charismatic, so he has a, a, that quality 
in them. But leave your comments about what you think. Can Deontay Wilder follow a script? Or will he just be the same Deontay Wilder once the fight breaks out? Boxing Opinions 100, and I'm out.